um, had a scared moment for a little bit because I felt a lot of, I felt like I was about to pass out. I'm, I'm pretty sure it's from anxiety, but anxiety brain's like, you're gonna die. Good morning, internet friends, or rather, good evening, internet friends. How are we doing today? Riddler says, I'm trying to get comfortable. <laughs> oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. I probably shouldn't be laughing at this, but you know, it's, it's pretty funny. Sassy is judging him on his ability to get comfortable. Do you feel better now? Are you just going to sit there? Yeah? Okay. And MRL is downstairs with my parents. No. Nope. Are you going are you trying to get on the bed? Go ahead. Come on, bud. You can get on the bed. Don't just look at me, you little goose. Riddler. Come on. Riddler, up. Up. Okay, fine, don't. Watch that the moment I turn the camera away, you are going to jump on my bed. Well done. I hear little paws at the door. Who is it? Let's go see who's at the door. Knock, knock, who's there? It's an emerald. Hi, buddy. Look how tall you are. He's actually close to emerald, to Riddler's height. Will you stand over there for a standing comparison? Stop lifting your head. He's literally... I think proportionally equal to Riddler, just obviously somebody is smaller. <coughs> ah, ah, boys! Hey, hey, ah, ah. Stop. Stop. So, how the day has been, because I have not gotten to how that's been. Hi, buddy! Hi! Are you guys just going to crowd around me while I'm trying to vlog? I'm also getting to your comments. See? Hi, guys! Um, you usually... I'll go and tell you now. If I'm replying to your comments, that usually means I'm editing the vlog at the same time. <laughs> hi! <laughs> Did you want to say hi to your internet friends? You guys like... POV licking! <laughs> You're such a dork! Oh, this is the dorkiest breed I've ever met in my life. Hi, you little cutie pie. Hey, yo. So, how the day has been if... Okay, Riddler, are you going to settle? Uh, Riddler, this is not how you vlog. This is not how you edit. That's not how any of this works. I'm going to click on that real quick. That's not how any of this works, bud. Can you get comfortable, please? I'm trying to tell the viewers how the day is. Unless you think you don't have enough screen time, is that your problem? Hey, uh-uh. Do not make my bed into a nest. Riddler, get comfortable, dude. Majestic breed right here. So anyways, so how the day has been? Um, so I had interning. That was pretty fun. Um, the highlight of my day was feeding cooked pasta to a sloth. That was awesome. Um, ah, 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 ah. No, sir, you are not clawing on my quilt. No. Here, I'm going to move the quilt out of the way. Get off of it. Ah. It's a nice quilt, and I don't want you to ruin it with your claws. That pillow eventually needs to be replaced, so whatever. Hi, Riddler. Can I talk about... Can I talk to the people, please? Can I talk to our friends? You're being rude! And then, let's see. It's been storming today. There was a tornado warning. Not watch. Tornado warning at work. And just in case you didn't know the difference, because sometimes I get confused too. A tornado warning is when the weather conditions are right for a tornado. Doesn't mean what has been seen. A watch is when a tornado has landed. So... Fun fact for the day. Yay! So, I got to go home a little bit early because we got stuff with our dent. 
we got done with our stuff early. What the crap, Raven? Talk. <laughs> got home. Had some family friends over. So I had to keep all three of the dogs in my room, which this one is the most annoying about it because he's the most FOMO dog in the face of the world. FOMO equals fear of missing out. So this is him. The one that I said that is the one that acts more neurotic. That's this one. He's special though. Special boy. Um, he was standing at the door. He was crying. He was flipping out. And he was making MRL bark. And made sassy bark. And basically it was just really annoying. Um, what else happened? I did some alert training with MRL. My anxiety is actually going up. So sometimes if he can't hear this. I'll start scratching on fabric. Let me see if he'll do it for you guys. What? Who are you barking at? Mm -hmm. uh -uh. Don't you bark at him. No. Emeril. What do you do? Yes, good boy! Yay! So sometimes he will alert to this. A lot of times I have to be scratching on something so he hears it better. But we're working on it. I also got another sample. I bought some gauze pads and sandwich bags at the Dollar Tree. Oh, my mouth is just suddenly remembering what it feels like to have the gauze pad in my mouth. No. <laughs> um, so I got a sample of that. And then when I used the scent jars later, I also got two more gauze pads and I covered them in water so that they will have completely different smells and he would have to figure out which one's which so I did that um had a scared moment for a little bit because I felt a lot of I felt like I was about to pass out I'm, I'm pretty sure it's from anxiety but anxiety brain's like you're gonna die and I'm like no no brain but like I was feeling lightheaded I kind of collapsed onto my bed really lightheaded couldn't breathe really dizzy my vision was blurring it just wasn't going well so I'm not really sure what happened there of course my brain's like you're gonna die but no so now I've finally gotten up and I'm working on the vlog um I was gonna take a shower but it is thundering outside and I kind of don't want to be struck by lightning so I'm going to work on the vlog while these little goobers play on the floor and this wonderful doggy sleeps. And I will check back in with you later. Hey guys! So, there's my little boy falling asleep on my bed. There's my bigger dogs asleep on the couch. And I'm actually feeling kind of tired despite not having my Ambien because I ran out. Ow. Tangle. Um, I decided to do a little multitasking while... The vlog was uploading. I did a little bit of light yoga. I did like this <clears throat> about 10 minute routine from Sarah Beth Yoga for the neck and shoulders and that felt wonderful. And then I was like, you know what? My back is also feeling tense. And I found one that's for bedtime, which means I don't have to get off my bed. So I went ahead and did that one. That one was 30 minutes long. And tonight, like, my brain did not want to focus in. Like, the whole point was to be present and, life, be present with your breath. Notice what your breath is doing. And usually I can do that when doing yoga. But my brain was just wandering everywhere. It was like, nah, I don't want to. And let's not clear. So, I may see if I can re-download this app called Headspace that I once had a while back. But I used up the free 10 days. I wonder if I can try it again. Um... It's a great meditation app, and it really helped me to clear my head before I went to bed. So, we'll just see what happens there. But, now, before I fall asleep, I'm going to sign off for the night and head off to bed. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've had a wonderful day or night, rain or shine, whatever the world has for you today. Question of the day is, do you have any particular bedtime routines? Like, is there something or some things you do before bed? Uh, I don't have a set routine. <laughs> so put your answers down below and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Good night, little boy. Good night, bigger boy. Good night, bigger girl.